Greetings again, future minions. Welcome back to Paper Mario No Grinding. So, between recordings, I gave three of the four seeds to the what's-her-face here. I didn't pay attention to her name because I don't care. But I saved the last one for you all to watch what happens. You brought me the seed! Thank you! Just like the flowers were blooming, but then a door appeared. It must be. You must be able to go to flower fields. They need your aid. Please help them. Oh, and there's Colorado telling me that Ken C. Koopa's blocking the road. Sorry about your luck, pal. He's not required. Chapter 6 Dark Days in Flower Fields. Oh, look up here, son. They call me the wise Wisterwood. I am the oldest tree here in the flower fields. Land of trees, flowers, grasses, plants. All, fo all forms of flora, but that's too much to go into. You must be Mario. I've heard a lot about you, son. You're trying to do your best to save the star spirits and the rest of the world. Very noble. But if that's true, then your rival means a star spirit is here in our land. I would help you in your quest, but alas, I cannot, for Flower Fields is in trouble. A creature named Huff and Puff and his followers invaded our fair land not long ago. These creatures have brought clouds to our sunny sky and it has been dark ever since. The sun doesn't even bother to rise anymore. We are all weak and fading. But I remember something. The rumors that Huff and Puff is holding somebody captive. It must be the star spirit that you're searching for. Of course! Oh-ho? Uh -huh. You're going to defeat Huff and Puff then? Well, that would make the wishes of flower fields come true. But it's not easy. Huff and Puff is up in the sky. In what we call the cloudy climb. There's no way up there at the moment. But you might be able to reach it if you can find a magical bee. Or something that grows high. But wait a minute. I think there is a flower that has a magical bean somewhere. I believe her name is Petunia. Perhaps she's off to the east. It would not hurt to go visit her. The other flowers and bulbs around here might have useful information as well. Talk to everyone. Yeah, talk to everyone. No. Okay, that way I think is to the the Puff Puff machine, I think. Yeah, you need Lucky Lester for this area. Oh, is there anything back here? Invisible walls! Crazy daisies! Crazy daisies! And bees! Bees! Ah! Do you have a second? Listen to my sad tale. Ever since the sun went away, I've begun to droop. I have no energy at all. Without the sun, it seems like the whole world is just sad. But now these Monty Moles are digging into the ground and biting my roots. Woe is me. My beautiful seed collection will become a Monty Mole bouquet. A banquet. Okay, <laughs> banquet, if this keeps up. Hey sir, you look strong. Could you get rid of these Monty Moles? In case you're wondering, the Monty Moles I'm talking about are... That asshole. This jerk. And this bastard. And this motherfucker here. And this guy as well. You don't need to be concerned with that one. Don't fail me! My seeds and I are counting on you to save us! Alright. 
Jeez. Okay. That's a lot of money, moles. I'm gonna get a level up after this. Well, that's the case. Star Storm, bitches! Trying to spin jump into these. All right, fine. I'll hit you with a hammer. How's that? Whack a mole. Ow. Damage dodge, they only do one. Excellent. Fine by me. What? They must have 12 HP on the on the dot. Ow. Yep, 12 on the dot. Whack. Where do you think you're going? Monty moles are the... They're the least of your worries in flower fields, trust me on that. of uh, happiness. <laughs> you got rid of the money moles! Thank you! To show you how grateful I am, I'll give you this magic bean! Hmm? Oh yes, my name is Petunia. They call me the Seed Maniac. Nice to meet you. By the way, about that magic bean, you shouldn't plant it. Why not? Because as a seed, it will enjoy freedom! After it's planted and sprouts up, it won't ever be able to move again. Don't you think that's sad? Please do not plant it with, oh, for instance, fertile soil and miracle water. I don't want to think about a sprout growing out of my cute little seed. No! Actually, I'm going to eat one of these for health.
You have to, there's a, like berry puzzles you have to solve with these. Isn't there a well over here? Oh, that's right. You have to throw a specific berry into this well and you get something for it. Alright, I'll throw a red berry in. Who's throwing stuff in my well? Well, whoever it is, you deserve this for rudeness. Ah! B! Bees! Ah! <laughs> Who the hell is throwing stuff in my well? Or out for your blood. Okay, so I have to find which way the red berry corresponds. Nope, it's not you. One of the berries you throw in the well, and the guy's like, the guy's like, oh, thank you for bringing me that. Oh, here we are, red berry. Hello, stranger. Who do you think? What do you think of my bright red coloring? Isn't it nice? What's that? You want to pass through? I'm sorry, I couldn't let you through. Um, that is, of course, I can make an exception if you give me something delicious. Here, have a berry. Hmm, delicious. Great color. Perfect. You're a champ for bringing me such a tasty snack. Of course you can go through. Bees! Oh, that's a tough puff. Yellow berries. I'm just eating these right now for recovery. Look at this crystal tree. Have you ever seen anything so beautiful? Oh, excuse me. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Posey. What's wrong with my mouth? Well, that's my nose, silly. How rude. Well, anyway, it was this fertile soil that made my nose grow so long. I happen to like it. <laughs> Your nose is pretty nice, too. It's tend to be a little bit longer, so why don't you take this fertile soil with you? Your nose will be perfect. <laughs> I need a yellow berry. There's a blueberry too, which I may try to use that at the well instead of the yellow one. Yeah, 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 bee, bee. Well, if I'm wrong, I can always get a yellow berry. Try again. Good day, Mario. It's great to see you. I'm the guard of this gate. I must tell you, though, I don't let many people through. I have excellent tasting food, though, so if you bring me something that's sufficiently tasty, I'll let you through. You have anything? Yeah, I got a, rip a yellow berry. Magnificent! Sweet and subtle flavor with a delicate finish. Marvelous coloring. Reminds me of the warm sunlight I so yearn for. I'm truly taken aback by your cultured taste. You may pass. Oh boy, there's a lot of crazy daisies. Barring the way. No. 
No, 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 no. I'm not gonna take that. I'm not gonna risk it. Blueberry! Oh, of course. Uh... I don't want to come back. I guess I'll have to come back. I mean, it's... whoa, 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 star piece. Dizzy dial, who cares? Well, with the Ultra Hammer, the good thing is I can find star pieces under the ground more easily. Like that! Oh, how horrible! The spring went dry! What a tragedy! This can't happen to me, not to Lily! Somebody that... the horrible thing that rides the clouds took our precious stone! Water flows from that magic stone. Without it, the spring will never recover, and I'll wither up, and if I can't float on the water, I'll be crushed by my own weight and wither to die. Poor Lily. Don't give up. Perhaps a handsome prince will arrive and help you. Oh. A prince? Well, he looks more like a plumber, but beggars can't be choosers. My name is Lily. I'm a beautiful, fragile flower who lives in this spring. Tell the truth, I have a... I have to ask you to do me a favor. Could you please get my water stone back from that horrible cloud creature? Mm-hmm. You're a dream come true. Thank you. It looks like this. Please find it. Jam and jelly. Oh, shoot. Yeah, and there's the bubble. The bubble tree, so I'm gonna need that later. I'm gonna have to come back here for a uh, blueberry. Because I'm going to throw this one down the well. B! Ow! Again. Blueberry! <laughs> Who's throwing stuff down in my well? Oh, it's a blueberry. I love these! I'll give this to you. Flower seed. I spent 25 star pieces on this badge. Five star pieces on a badge I, I could have gotten for free. Ugh. I could. I should have did power. Ugh. Well, it's not gonna matter. It's not like I could have quit both anyway. Ugh. What a waste. Blueberry.
I'm gonna save that block for Lackey Lester when I get him. Alright, real quick. One of these is for the blueberry. Okay, that's the bubble plant. I need to go this way, I think. Ah, here we are. I'm tired of guarding this stupid old gate. I'm hungry. I don't suppose you got anything good to eat. Give you some succulent, I'll let you through. Delicious! Splendid taste! These are good blue things. I'm filled with hope. Go and never feel blue. I'll never forget. Onward! Oh, a shooting star. Whoa! Where'd you drop it, you idiot? Huff and Puff will have our clouds if we don't have find it. Oh man, I'm so clumsy. That stone gave out an endless supply of water. Without it, we can't increase the power of the Puff Puff machine. It's gotta be around here somewhere. It has to be. What? That's Mario. Look, man! Let's go look for the stone later. Let's rough him up. Oh no, Mario, you sure? I'm not sure if I'm, you know, in the right mental state. I'll forget it. I'll fight anyway. Here it comes. Ooh. This could be rough. Okay, two spinies are down. I do remember it is that one. Money, money. Oh, hello. Seems like ages since I've had a visitor. I'm Rosie, a rose spirit. So glad to meet you. Here I am in full bloom and nobody to look at me. Please admire me all you like. Breathtaking, aren't I? Sure, lady. Really? I'm beautiful? You're so honest. And underneath that scruffy mustache, I bet you're handsome. I like you. And because I like you, I will show you this. This stone isn't beautiful. I found it just the other day. Some strange creatures on clouds dropped it. I couldn't resist its gorgeous glitter, so I made it mine. I could look at it all day. Huh? What did you say? I should give you the stone. Oh dear, you're saying Lily's in trouble without it? How sad. Oh well, but it can't be helped. The stone is mine now. You mean Lily will wither up and die without it? How sad. How very pitiful. As hard as it is to believe that Lily sometimes acts like she's prettier and prissier than I am. She's dumb, but she's not evil. But she's a bitch. But then again, I need a, I need a nemesis. And if she's gone, there'll be no flowers to set off my beauty. Let's see. Tell you what. You bring me something more beautiful than the stone, and I will think about trading it. Wait until then. And 
and that's the start of a big fetch quest. Alright, let's get to the same point first. Hey! enough for this episode, so I'll do that fetch quest for the Waterstone next time. So, thank you so much for watching. Catch you next time.